turns out two minutes goes super duper fast. So um, for client retention, I am nominating Carrie Olwig um, for this particular category because Carrie doesn't have a ton of time open because she was a stay at home mom for a really long time. In 2014, she came to us, you know, so Carrie's juggling family and she became a trainer. Um, so with that said, since 2014, she's kept most of the clients that she's gotten since then. Um, but the thing that's great about Carrie's client retention is not only has she retained her clients for the past four years, but we've had multiple trainers leave that were training these clients for years. And Carrie's the kind of person that brings in the customer service and somehow re-signs these people that are super angry that their trainer left. Um, for example, um, Tina Hess, she was with another trainer, didn't have a heart attack with that other trainer, but um, had a heart attack and then the trainer was gone and she was given to Carrie and she's actually been with us ever since um, her trainer left and post, um, post heart attack. Um, Amy Boyle is a really good example because Amy actually came from the callback log, which is awesome. Um, one of those that we just happened to miss, Carrie Siner has been training her since 2014. Valerie Bogutsky is another one that she's had forever. Debbie Landers, Bill Quillo, um, Becky McDermott. So most of these people she's had for a really long time, but I think what's so special about her is not only does she re-sign her people, but every time it comes to a re-sign, it's not like it's just, oh, another re-sign, this and that. She always has a slice of humble pie and she's like, I hope I did enough. I want to get their, um, I want to get their goals and everything again. She sits down with them every month, gets new goals, makes sure she's accomplishing them. Um, so yeah, she just goes above and beyond for the clients she has and re-signs those ones whose trainers leave and we keep them on board. So don't be scary, vote for Carrie.